Hello from the Bureau, with an update on the coastal low impacting eastern parts of New South Wales and Victoria. Heavy rain fell across much of coastal New South Wales last night, with some of the heaviest falls around the central and southern coasts, where widespread 50 to 150 millimetres fell. Flash flooding was also observed in several towns overnight. Some of the heaviest falls in the 24 hours to 9 o'clock this morning include 188 millimetres at Nords Wharf and 185 millimetres at Watamolla. Strong to damaging winds also occurred this morning, with gusts up to 113 kilometres an hour observed at Ulladulla and 98 kilometres an hour at Montague Island. Now the coastal low causing all of this weather is currently off the central New South Wales coast and severe weather warnings for damaging winds, heavy rainfall and dangerous surf is current for parts of New South Wales from Gosford all the way down to the Victorian border. Severe weather warnings are also current for eastern parts of Victoria for damaging winds and heavy rainfall. While out on the waters, gale to storm force winds are expected there today. Widespread rain is continuing across much of southeastern New South Wales and eastern Victoria with moderate to heavy falls likely. Particularly about coastal parts of New South Wales and the elevated areas of eastern Victoria. Damaging winds are also occurring along the southern coastal parts of New South Wales this morning and these winds are expected to increase later today and spread further north and west overnight with winds possibly gusting to 120 kilometres an hour around alpine areas of Victoria. These winds and rain will slowly ease later on Tuesday as the low weakens and moves further offshore. Wind and rain are not the only concern with this low. Large and powerful surf with beach erosion is expected for much of the southern and central coast of New South Wales, in particular the south facing surf zones. This is especially concerning for the vulnerable central coast which suffered significant erosion with the last coastal low. Earlier this morning a wave ride buoy off the coast of Batemans Bay recorded a significant wave height over 5 metres. Hazardous and dangerous surf warnings are current for much of the central and southern coasts of New South Wales, with conditions not expected to ease until at least Wednesday. So with severe weather continuing, remember to stay up to date with the latest official forecasts and warnings on our website and app, and always listen to all advice from emergency services.